Good morning. It is Monday, day eight. Last day. I have 24, 25k to go, which is um, including the bit from the end of the path to Eastmore Station, which would actually be, apart from that day I hid from the rain, that would be the shortest, shortest distance. But, so, pretty comfortable, hopefully, especially with a bit of fitness. Just a small matter of the Seven Sisters and lots of up and down. But I've, uh, I've got a train booked for six o'clock, which I'm actually worried of. I might actually have booked for too late. But I had to book one, nine pounds compared with uh, 20, 30. Uh, for just a turn up ticket, worth doing. Uh, it's a good excuse to have some fish and chips for dinner, isn't it? On the seafront. Um, so the plan now is to go over that hillside and then drop down into Alfriston, which will be uh, it's about 4k, I reckon. I 4k to Alfriston, I can have some breakfast, just generally chill for a bit there. Um, that's what I'm going to do today, I'm just going to take it, take it easy, but with an eye on how much I've still got to do. I do not want to miss that train. And uh, just just enjoy it really at a, at a sensible pace. You know, I've done the hard work, just have to get to the finish now. Right, let's get on with it.
Please. Sure. Like that in the corner and a tub. Uh, Karen, please. Thank you. Hello. On the uh, the last bit now. Hopefully you can see the Seven Sisters behind me. Just left Berlin Gap after an ice cream. And got five miles into Eastbourne now. Um, and the biggest climb of the day. Speech ahead. And then we're done. Beachy head, got two, all the way to the Seven Sisters. And you can barely see the other bit. Looks a long way, feels like a long way. And this is the trick. No man, I can hear. Should be down here all the way, which would be nice. Right, it's time, it's quarter to three, and I've got maybe four K okay, to do. Down to Eastbourne, I think. Find the end post. It's Eastbourne. Hopefully, not much further. <laughs> <laughs> 